Hello, so I've got this uh, special request to do a Black Dog in a separate video, a Black Dog by uh, Led Zeppelin. So here I am doing it. And uh, it's a really cool song. Uh, it has some rhythmical um, intricacies that you need to uh, kind of grasp to, to be able to play it well. So let's do it. You'll need a G harmonica. Uh, this is the easy way, easiest way to play it. Um, you mostly won't need any overblows for this. Um, there's like a second voice, the second harmony to to the uh, to the lick played in Black Dog, and uh, maybe there you might want to use some overblows. So let's do it now. The main lick. It's pretty easy because it's just um, a pentatonic minor pentatonic scale, I think most of the time with one passing note, and that is that is it. And um, the tricky thing is to kind of start playing at the right time. Um, what they do is they add kind of extra beat to the second bar of of uh, the vocal part. So you can do it, you can count either four and five, or you can go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, but do but you got three sixteenth notes, I think. So da 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 da, yeah, da da da, pi da di ba. So that's um, so you have you have to uh, you have to divide that last B into four cards. And um, omit the first one, da do ba. Actually, if you if you listen carefully in the original recording, you can hear uh, John Bonham like doing the metronome with uh, with his uh, sticks. You can hear that, uh, yeah, the beat there. So let's try. Yeah, so uh, what you do, you can hear that, uh, you can hear the symbol that I think it's crash symbol that Bonham does. Um, and then you start counting, that's the one, the B1, one, two, three, four. Um, and in, when, in, in the third repetition of that link, um, he kind of uh, transposes the, the link. Um, what is that? It's like um, a fourth uh, lower, like an interval of fourth. So instead of so you the oh sorry <laughs> and you go back to that uh, original lick. So yeah. It's probably tapped down here, so... <laughs> Alright, so that's the most interesting part, I think, and uh, he does some uh, melody chordal thing uh, over the uh, over the chorus, and um, it's not that difficult to to get. So um, again, it's uh, in the third position. That kind of stuff. Um, 
What's more interesting is that uh, second harmony, like the second voice of, of the harmony, because he adds uh, another layer to the to the basic riff he plays later on. So instead of playing, so he also keeps playing that, but second guitars play, second guitar plays. So it plays something different. And altogether, it gives a really nice, um, really nice harmony. So uh, check that out. Uh, after that, there's on the solo part. It might be interesting. I'm not going to do that because it's just um, it's just a minor pentatonic scale. It's not anything that you wouldn't be able to improvise. Uh, you figure it out. Uh, there's one maybe lick he plays before that. And it does that, and it plays the solo. And that's all. Um, pretty cool, I think. And uh, so uh, have fun with counting, with um, uh, coming on the right beat. And let me know what kind of video you want to do next.